Well, the drivers have been shown the oil flag just prior to the start, and there's concrete dust on the braking zone for the final corner when they come back down the straight. Shouldn't be a problem for the start. Semi-final number two for the Euro RX round one, 2015, away from the line. Great start, Jerome Grosso on the inside, Vibe around the outside of him. So, oh, Vibe gives Jerome Grosso the attack. Janin looks like he's left it too late on the brakes. Oh, side with downhill, Vibe's up the inside of him. Janin's bullish about it. He tries desperately to hold on, and he does. Fantastic drive from him. He leads with Welfrinson. Oh, Welfrinson was third, and he's off into the barriers. Technical problem for Welfrinson now that the third hit. Great job by Yannick. He just got a bit of contact with Baby's been in the back of him again at the hairpin. I think you can see this tyre smoke as body works rubbing. But he was very, very um, aggressive back there. Yeah, he sat it out around the outside, he closed the door, just got enough of an overlap to get the door shut on Baby. But Baby was very persistent into the hairpin. A right, little tap to the back. But now Yannick's away, eyes forward. Very closely matched on these two. Yannick can be really, really quick on the weekend. I see very at home with the very, the, the team are very impressed with him. He's got a lot of experience. All sorts of things. Brave he was as well on the brakes into that zone at the top of the hill where the dust is down. I've just chucked it in. Not remotely worried about that. There's dust all over the track. He's just gone for it. Real confidence in the car. We've seen that from Christopherson, the leader as well. This VW team sweep car is just a weapon. It looks like it really absorbs the bumps and the curves very well. As does the Alien's car. He's been very quick in the French National Championship the last few years. Um, he's very quick um, when he came to the World Championship last year. So it's great to see him put in a, a full assault in the European Championship. These three out front won't know just yet. Karai alongside him. We saw bad behaviour from Karai on the straight yesterday, but this time it's clean. He gets on the race five. He's pushed wide. That's going to cost him time. He's going to be bottled up behind him now. I'd say that's just not maybe the race on the jump. It's a challenge to get him for the win. You know, they, they called him to go to the Joker lap, and he really needed to come out in front. And now he's being held up. Um, so this is playing into Yannick's hand. He can just keep his eyes forward. He knows there's no real threat from behind. No, keep him in his mind. Do not be too hard on the car. Actually, the final's going to drip him down for the second.